Want to speak real Chinese from your first lesson? Sign up for your free lifetime account at ChineseClass101.com. Hey guys, welcome back. I'm Kate. Today I will show you top ten Chinese snacks. Let's just get started. Oh, alright, the first one. 大白兔奶糖大白兔奶糖 White Rabbit Creamy Candy. Let's try it. Okay, so this one, 大白兔奶糖 Okay, I really like it. It's very very sweet. 非常的甜 Hmm, hmm, hmm. Hmm, happy smell. Almost all Chinese children like 大白兔奶糖 If you don't believe, just try it. Second one, 美好时光海苔 Sweet our seaweed. Now let me try. All right, so it's just like this. Hmm. Not bad. It's just normal seaweed. Next one, very special. 辣条 spicy gluten. 辣条 Now I will try this. It's my favorite. 真真 All right, so it's very very spicy, but I pretty like spicy food. So yes, 辣条 is my favorite. Now I will try. Very special. I don't know whether you can buy nut tiao in your country, but it's very popular in China. All right, next one. 小米锅巴小米锅巴 minute crisp. It's just like chips. Now let me try. All right, so it. So like this, very cute.、Mm, yes, just like chips. Sorry, I just can't not stop. It's really, really delicious. I pretty like it. Next one, 小小酥小小酥 So it's one kind of popping food. All right, so yes, a cute little 小小酥 Hmm, pretty good. I bet you will like it. I like it. Next one, 溜溜梅溜溜梅 It is made of plum. It's very very sour, but I like it. I like sour and spicy food. So yes, 溜溜梅 is one of my favorite. Yes, this one, 溜溜梅 Okay, so ooh, look at it. Hmm, very sour and a little sweet. Alright, so this one, Wang Wang Xian Bei, Wang Wang Xian Bei. It is also one kind of popping food. And when I was very young. I pretty pretty like this. Okay, so, 旺旺鲜贝 
it's a little salty but very very delicious amazing food okay one of my favorite snacks again Next one, Huang Zai Xiao Man Tou Crunch Rice Balls. Very cute, this one. Little rice balls, crunch rice balls. It's very sweet, mm, but actually, I don't really like it. Mm. QQ Tang. QQ Tang, QQ Gummy Candies. Alright, so look. Very soft. Mm. That's great. Sweet and a little sour. I think girls will like it. Okay, the last one, yu doufu, yu doufu, fish with bean curd. You have to try this. It's really, really great. Alright, so this one is a little spicy. just like tofu mm. they were delicious all right now please leave a comment let me know what Chinese snacks do you want to try please leave a comment leave a comment and okay it is today's Chinese class if you want to know more Chinese culture or more Chinese food please Leave a comment, let me know. And if you like my videos, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up. See you next time. Bye bye. Welcome to Fun and Easy Chinese by ChineseClass101.com. Hi, 大家好，我是李音如 Hi, everybody. In Ruli here. Can you say and sing Happy Birthday in Chinese? If you're a Chinese learner and if you enjoy celebrating birthdays. Happy birthday is a must-know phrase for you to learn. In this lesson, you will learn how to say happy birthday in Chinese, and how to sing the happy birthday song in Chinese in two ways, and some other phrases to wish someone a happy special day. Happy birthday in Chinese is 生日快乐生日快乐 The first phrase 生日 means birthday. 生日 And the second one, 快乐 means happy, 快乐 So together, 生日快乐 birthday, happy, or in the English order, happy birthday, 生日快乐 If you'd like to wish someone a happy certain year old birthday, you can add the year before 生日快乐 For example, happy three year old birthday is 三岁生日快乐 Sun means three, and Sui means year or age. San Sui, three year old, and San Sui, 生日快乐 Happy three year old birthday. San Sui, 生日快乐 And San Shi Sui, 生日快乐 is Happy thirty year old birthday. San Shi means thirty. San Shi. 三十岁生日快乐 In China, like many other countries around the world, people like to gather around the birthday cake and sing the happy birthday song to the birthday boy or girl before blowing out the candles. The song is the same melody as everybody knows, and there are two versions of lyrics of this song. The more simple version, which is the most commonly used one, has only one phrase. And this phrase is repeated four times throughout the song. This phrase is, 祝你生日快乐。祝你生日快乐。The second part of this expression, 生日快乐 we already know, meaning 
、uh, it means happy birthday. The first part, 祝你 means wish you. 祝 means to wish. 祝 and 你 is you. 你 together. 祝你生日快乐 To put 祝你生日快乐 to the melody, it goes like this. 祝你生日快乐，祝你生日快乐，祝你生日快乐，祝你生日快乐。There is another version of the Chinese Happy Birthday song with a few more phrases. Growing up in China, I did not know this version of Happy Birthday until I went to a karaoke place and saw the added phrases. This version or this set of lyrics are not、um, used quite as often, but it's good for you to know and learn a couple more Chinese phrases. The lyrics go like this: 祝你生日快乐，祝你生日快乐，祝你幸福，祝你健康，祝你前途光明，祝你生日快乐，祝你生日快乐，祝你幸福，祝你健康，拥有温暖家庭。The first new phrase in this set of lyrics is 祝你幸福，祝你幸福 We know 祝你 is wish you, and the second phrase 幸福 means happy or bless. 幸福 together 祝你幸福 wish you happy, 祝你幸福 and the next 祝你 is 祝你健康，祝你健康。健康 means healthy. 健康 so 祝你健康 is wish you good health. 祝你健康 and the one after 祝你健康 is 祝你前途光明祝你前途光明前途 means、uh, literally means the road ahead, but it's often translated as future. 前途 the next one 光明 means、um, Bright, 光明，前途光明 ，a bright future. 祝你前途光明 ，wish you a bright future. 祝你前途光明。Well, the last phrase of this version of lyrics is, 拥有温暖家庭，拥有温暖家庭，拥有 the first phrase means to have or to possess. 拥有。温暖 means warm. 温暖 Last, 家庭 means family. 家庭 All together, 拥有温暖家庭 To have a warm family, 拥有温暖家庭 Now let's read the whole lyrics together. 祝你生日快乐，祝你生日快乐，祝你幸福，祝你健康。Wish you happy. Wish you health. Wish you good health. 祝你前途光明 Wish you a bright future. 祝你生日快乐祝你生日快乐祝你幸福祝你健康拥有温暖家庭 Have a warm family. Are you ready to sing it? Let's sing it together slow. 祝你生日快乐，祝你生日快乐，祝你幸福，祝你健康，祝你前途光明，祝你生日快乐，祝你生日快乐。Again， 祝你幸福，祝你健康。拥有温暖家庭。Not only on birthdays do we wish others happiness. There are many other special days we can say happy special day to each other. In Chinese, holiday greetings also use the phrase 快乐 and the pattern is holiday plus 快乐 For example, 新年 is New Year. 新年新 means new. And 年 means year. 新年快乐 is Happy New Year. 新年快乐 Well, even though celebrating Christmas is not a tradition in China, Chinese people still are familiar with Christmas 
and love the Christmas spirit. You can wish others a Merry Christmas by saying 圣诞快乐 meaning Merry Christmas. 圣诞 is Christmas. 圣诞圣诞快乐 Merry Christmas. You can use this、um, special day plus 快乐 pattern on anniversaries as well. Happy anniversary in Chinese is 周年快乐周年快乐周 means a circle. 周 and 年 means year. 周年 a circle year or anniversary. 周年快乐 Happy anniversary. 周年快乐 We can add more information before 周年快乐 like we did with 生日快乐结婚十周年快乐 is Happy tenth wedding anniversary. 结婚十周年快乐。结婚 means to get married or to be married. 结婚。And next, 十 is a number meaning ten. 十 So 结婚十周年 means to be married for ten years or the tenth anniversary, the tenth year of being married. 结婚十周年快乐。Now let's review the key phrases we learned in this lesson. The four character、um, phrase for happy birthday is 生日快乐，生日快乐。If the person you're saying 生日快乐 to is turning three years old, the more specific phrase you can use is 三岁生日快乐，三岁生日快乐。And how about the phrase for "wish you"? 祝你，祝你。And how do you say "wish you a happy birthday" like in the happy birthday song? 祝你生日快乐，祝你生日快乐。We can use this special day plus 快乐 pattern to say "Happy New Year," which in Chinese is. 新年快乐，新年快乐 ！Great job! Want to learn the language fast with PDF cheat sheets? You can get cheat sheets for all kinds of topics, travel, hobbies, love, and much more. And you will learn all of the must-know words and phrases for each. So click the link in the lesson description and sign up for a free lifetime account to get them. That will be all for this lesson. 祝你天天快乐 ！Wish you happy every day. 再见 Thank you for watching. Hi everyone. Do you know how to introduce yourself in Chinese? Today we are going to learn ten lines for introducing yourself. 我的名字是雨婷 My name is 雨婷我的名字是 My name is. The more casual way to say your name is, uh, 我叫雨婷 Uh, I'm called 雨婷你好，很高兴认识你。Hello, nice to meet you. 你好，很高兴认识你。您好，呃、uh, ，you just can use 您好 to the respectable person. For example, your teacher, your leader. 呃、uh, ，but you can't use in the same generation, friends. If you want to use for friends, you can use 你好 You can say like that. 你好，很高兴见到你 Or 你好，很高兴认识你我来自中国 I'm from China. 我来自中国 I'm from China. And if you want to introduce more about yourself,、uh, because China is so big, I want to say that I came from the north part of China. 哦、uh, ，我来自中国的北方。我住在北京 I live in Beijing. 我住在北京 I live in Beijing. When you introduce yourself, you can use 我住在 <laughs> For myself, I live in 呼伦贝尔我住在呼伦贝尔呼伦贝尔 is my hometown. Please visit my hometown, 呼伦贝尔 You are super welcome. 我是一名学生 I'm a student. 我是一名学生。You can tell you occupation, your career. For example,、uh, you are a teacher. You can say, 我是一名老师。And、uh, if you are an engineer, you can speak, 啊、uh, ，我是一名工程师
呃，医生 ，doctor， lawyer， 律师 ，and、uh, if you work for government, you can speak. 呃、uh, ，我是公务员，我二十四岁 ，I'm twenty four years old. Okay, next one. Tell your age. Ha ha ha. Maybe sometimes you don't want to tell your age. That is okay. 我今年二十四岁。I'm twenty-four years old. 我的爱好是摄影。My hobby is photography. 我的爱好是摄影。<笑> My hobby is photography, and also I love travel. 呃、uh, ，而且我也喜欢旅行。你喜欢旅行吗 ？Do you like to travel? 我喜欢听音乐。I enjoy listening to music. 我喜欢听音乐。I enjoy listening to music, and also I also enjoy cooking. 我喜欢做饭。And watching movie, 看电影。我学习中文已经二十四年了。I have been learning Chinese for twenty four years. 我学习中文已经二十四年了。I have been learning Chinese for Twenty four years. How long have you been studying Chinese? 你学中文多长时间了？我的梦想是成为一名中文老师。My dream is to be a Chinese teacher. 我的梦想是当一名中文老师。My dream is to be a Chinese teacher. So here I am. I hope you can enjoy my lesson. 我希望你们喜欢我的中文课。Okay, guys. That's all for today's lesson. Today we learned ten lines you need for introducing yourself. And if you have some questions, please comment below. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. I have been learning Chinese for twenty four years. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Today we are going to talk about the. Ten phrases you always want to hear. Hmm. You today 气色不错 You look great today. You 今天气色不错 You look great today. Hmm. You 今天气色不错哦 For girls, you can say like, "You 今天真漂亮 That means you are so beautiful today. For boys, you can say like, "Hmm. You 看起来真精神今天 Hmm. That means you look great today. You 真棒 You are awesome. You 真棒 You are awesome. Chinese people like to compliment people, especially during the working or study. When you make a small progress, they will say some compliment like You 真棒 You are awesome. 你是对的 You are right. 啊、oh, ，你是对的。今天真的下雨了。Uh, you are right. Today is really raining. 你是对的。今天真的下雨了。You are right. It's raining. 干得漂亮。You did a great job. 干得漂亮。You did a great job. You are playing basketball and、uh, you got a goal. And your teammate will say, "You did a great job." 干得漂亮。我想你。I miss you. 我想你 ，I miss you. For I miss you, maybe you can use the very close friends and、uh, family member. But if you want to say I miss you to your teacher or your boss, you can speak like 我很想念您 And also, this sentence is like just used for the letter. And、uh, if you want to email your teacher, and you can speak, 啊、uh, ，敬爱的老师。我很想念您。我给你带了些礼物。I brought you some gifts. 我给你带了些礼物。I brought you some presents. In China, if your friends invited you to their home for the dinner, if you want to keep the good manner,、uh, it's better you bring some gift. The present doesn't have to be very expensive, just like fruit and tea. It's okay. 月底发奖金 There will be a bonus at the end of the month. I think everyone loves the salary. Is that right? And also in China, in the end of the year, 
during the Spring Festival, every boss, the good boss, will offer the employee a big bonus. We call it Hong Bao. You are in good shape. 你身材真好. You are in good shape. To be honest, guys, this sentence is really, really important. So please remember this. 你身材真好. Especially when you meet a girl, you can speak. So first, 你真漂亮. The second, 你身材真好. That means you are beautiful and you are in good shape. The girls will be really, really happy. 你做的对. You did the right thing. 你做的对. You did the right thing. I think everyone wants to do the right thing, right? And uh, someone will say, uh, You are right, you did the right thing. It's great. 我有一个惊喜要给你. I have a surprise for you. 我有一个惊喜要给你. I have a surprise for you. <laughs> Actually, sometimes when someone tell you, I have a surprise for you, you will imagine here, what kind of surprise? And sometimes it's really a surprise, a gift, but sometimes just your friends want to trick you. And uh, your friends will offer you a little creature. My friends always trick me like this. Okay, guys, today we did the 10 phrases you always want to hear. Which one would you like to hear? I highly recommend you remember the first, you are in good shape. 你身材真好. The second, you did the great job. Want to speed up your language learning? Take your very first lesson with us. You'll start speaking in minutes and master real conversations. Sign up for your free lifetime account. Just click the link in the description.